Okay, here we are at Ruben Gallego's viewing party. Right here, I have James Woods. He is running against Matt Salmon for District 5. James, what is it like being here today? I'm sorry? What is it like being here and supporting someone else who's trying to get in Congress as well? Uh, Ruben's campaign is pretty inspiring. Uh, his uh, standing up for the separation of church and state and marginalized populations and uh, his, his experiences as a veteran and advocating for veterans' rights and support is uh, it's, it's a really great cause and I'm re really happy he's doing so well and I'm looking forward to his victory this evening. You just said Ruben Gallego's really inspiring. So are you. You're going to be you're the only person who is blind who's running for Congress. What is that like? What are you trying to convey in your message? I'm trying to give voice to uh, marginalized populations and, and not just persons with disabilities, but uh, the LGBT community, uh, immigrants' rights groups, basically anyone who hasn't had a traditional voice in the system, I want to talk to and try and uh, listen to their issues and put that out in public so people can hear about it. Raising awareness for other people is really one of my main goals of my campaign. Okay, well, we're going to keep you updated today to see what ends up happening with the election. Reporting in Phoenix, Mackenzie Scott, Cronkite News.